She's a young entrepreneur who had some big dreams, but they aren't just dreams anymore. On this week's Focusing on the Future, CBS News Philadelphia reporter Wakisha Bailey checked back in with the now owner of a candle shop who is lighting the way for future entrepreneurs. Welcome to Dose Candles. She did it. Owner and operator Sanaya Thompson opened her first specialty candle, brick and mortar, inside Willow Grove Mall. Everything was like all white. All of the shelves were white. We literally just had to move our stuff in. We have passion fruit right here. Which Humbled and grateful, she showed off some of her favorite cupcake candles, along with a few new yummy scents. So we have our sugar cookie one, banana pudding, hot chocolate, caramel popcorn, vanilla lavender, cinnamon bun. I don't know if we had cinnamon bun last time. It's been just over a year since we first met Sanaya whipping up these dessert replica candles inside her small workshop. I make everything by hand, so not everything like the same. She now splits her time between her pop-up inside Cherry Hill Mall and her new retail store. And of course, along for the ride is her A-team. So this is mom, my right hand. Um, she's <laughs> usually here at the register. Um, checking people out while I'm making candles. So my grandma helps me from time to time with the wafers. <laughs> She's pretty good with all the extra stuff. We remember her grandmother. She traded in her Fruit Loops wax melts for banana wafers, a tedious task that's handled with love. How do you feel about your granddaughter having this beautiful store? A su poca edad que tiene. She says she feels very proud of everything that I've did and accomplished in like my um, younger age. Sanaya has added a new candle line to the mix. She said, Mom, I'm going to start making cakes. And I'm just like, um, how are you going to make them? <laughs> she figured it out, custom candle cakes for maybe a birthday, wedding, or gender reveal party. This is about 22 pounds. It's pretty heavy. And it's just layers. Everything is complete soy wax. Although the store is filled with candles, it's also a place for young entrepreneurs to showcase their products, like this light installation. So many people have tried to help me, and I just want to be that person to like other young kids and just people around my age, so they're not too far from me. The store may have been Sanaya's dream, but it's a family business where customers also become family. Thanks for visiting Dulce Candles. Hope to see you guys soon. Well, Keisha Bailey, CBS News, Philadelphia.